Thank for, thanks for staying with us. We're still discussing um, the ministries, yes. Yeah, so I wanted to go to um, our former minister for sports because he, he was one of the ones I was expecting that he would be um, discharged and he was moved into a, a very strong ministry. He's moved into ministry, minister, of, he's now the minister of state, trade and investment industry. <coughs> and that ministry is a very, very oh, heavy strong one. ministry. Mm -hmm. And this, our uh, minister was, is, is a politician. Is, he, what, check, when you check him out, he's politician, farmer, and teacher, philanthropist. That's how he's being described on social. On social. I, we, going through his CV, I'm like, okay, it's not like he has accomplished okay, I'm sorry, because he has self for John Okeo Duwali was he's the one that was given Ministry of Industry, Trade and Investment. Or? No, I said Minister no, state, of State. state, state. Oh, he is the Minister of State. Okay, gotcha. So gotcha. I, I sort of, so that, we're, so that we're not speculating that we are just moving our political allies to remain in a position, move them to somewhere else. I would love for um, um, I, I would love for us to know the metric for which we can judge if he's performing or not oh, in this no, new yeah. position because this is what we're expecting. He was minister of sports. Many of us felt that there were gaps in that particular ministry under his ad administration, and we'd love to see that if he's down being moved to a, an even more important ministry, which is if there won't be trade gaps and investment, again. there won't be gaps there at all. And it would have been more appropriate to have someone within that in, mm. that that has yeah. background yeah. knowledge in that space to be the yeah. one. I'm also yeah, happy so. when I saw Dr. <coughs> Doris uh, Uzoka Nite. She's been moved to the Minister of State for Finance. Yes. Think. So she was taken yes. from the Ministry of Industry, yes. um, Trade and Investment. And yes. um, uh, we'll see how effective she'll be yeah. in this. Which other ones are anybody I happy? Would, I think there's a flow there. Do you understand? Mm, so yeah. Which other one were you happy about, uh, Maka? Any other one? Um, hmm. So those are the new, those are the minister, that's the, now, let's talk about Dr. The new ones. Okay. The let's new talk about ones. the new ones, the new guy. Yes. Yes. Let's start with... Um, we all know Dr. Jomoke because we are familiar with her from yes. the last administration. She was yes. a special advisor to, uh, I think, the vice president mm. of the economy, I believe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So she is now the minister of industry and trade and investment. Mm. And um, that's, that looks like it's a square peg in a yes. square hole. It, lo it looks like a perfect fit for her. And, and I, I definitely look forward to seeing her perform. I'm hoping that the bureaucracy will not stop her uh, ability mm. to, but she's been there. So, you she know, it's a different thing. Yeah. She's, she's worked within that system, so it should be easy. Bianca was interesting. I felt like yes. it was the standard. I think that's the, the right. It was appropriate, appropriate for the ministry. Southeast, and she's some, I don't, I don't know how strong her influence is, but because of the name and affiliation, name. yes, I think it was, it was, yes. you know, we need to always satisfy every region, and we need to, there must be inclusion. So I think it was a good inclusion. Yes, so I'm really happy about Bianca's own, uh, Bianca Juku's appointment, especially for, as a uh, foreign affairs, mm. because I feel that that suits her. Her personality. I feel that she's going to she's going to do great at it, and you know, congratulations, congratulations yeah. to her. I think yeah, I was happy to when helps. I saw her yes. name there. But the one that was most <clears throat> that could be most controversial, or is the is the renaming of the Ministry of Niger Delta Development to mm. Ministry of Regional Development to oversee the activities of the Regional Development Commissions. Now, this Regional Commission, I was saying, this is our Southwest does not need uh, does not need this kind of commission. He said the Regional Development Commission is to Supervise the new minister under the Niger Delta Development Commission, the Southeast Development Commission, mm. the Northeast Development, the Northwest Development Commission. So there's no Southwest Development Commission. So, but this, so this, so this ministry yes. now is going to supervise, so supervise all these regional. I think it's better. Is it? Yes, because we had a full ministry just okay. dealing with one, one issue. side. Yes. There, there one, are this and there are issues one region, in one regional, regional issue, not yeah. even. The, this, the, this development commission are meant to be interventions to deal with issues that are already on ground. Yes. Mm -hmm. So there's issue in Northeast. Do we need to set up another mini, a, a full ministry to deal with well, Northeast? Okay. We need to set up a full so ministry to deal with North. All so the every region, region yeah. where we have yeah. particular issues, insecurity in this place, yeah. banditry in this place, Nanya Delta, Nanya Delta was oh. because of the intervention of um, oil and, oil and uh, what was that the happened oil. to them that time? Yes. They were having the, the, um, the oil, food oil theft, yeah. um, kidnapping, bunkering. So th there were issues. So we wanted to inject funds to deal with those issues. And so they have gotten that um, a lot of injection of oh, funds would in that they be effective? So be interesting. I, I, my worry is I the think effective. Maybe I don't just don't know how they've not created more. I don't, I don't know, know how, I think. I don't know how effective. This this one Shopping. body would be yes because that's my point. these yes. are big regions with yes. big issues. Big issues mm. yeah. I don't even know how effective because ordinarily the one for for one region we, 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 we don't we don't see it's how effective it is. You do not see the effectiveness because there's corruption inside it. So I'm but not moving on. If they this, remove corruption, we'll see. This new overseeing region now is it not another way of making of, of making it spending you know, money and no. setting up.
Well, they've clamored the... and they clamored, they clamored that they yeah, also have you, issues. You, you, you have so you cannot give me to one region and not give me to another region. I have to, I'm I have to address. They should not give to another region. I have to address. Just saying this overall region, region. This, this supervisory role, role now that we are doing. Is it necessary? Many people are talking about here. Let us take it this way. Okay. Mm. I don't want us to continue that narrative with okay. Nigerian people. Mm. Once the government does anything, it's not just for to go and chop money. What is this? Boy? No, you know, no, no, no. Let us, you know I don't let, uh, I know. <laughs> but I want us, because even though there are people that talk like that, mm -hmm. let us also look at it. Let us be developmental journalists. Yes, which is what we are doing. And I'm <laughs> saying the commissions already exist. Okay. Yes. How effective have the commissions been so far? Yeah. Shouldn't we be looking at strengthening those commissions to make them stand? Now, the particular, uh, you said the Southwest does not have a commission. Imagine. Yeah, because you people don't have an issue. We don't have we an have issue. We have issues. Now, there's this, 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 So good. Then we can set up a set up a commission for that. But it's not, Sunday, it's on the loose. It's not, a, it's not a problem oh, that is affecting productivity. Enough to reach. Yes, enough for economy. us to set up a... No, but it's I'm just Let's not just gather commission because we want yeah. to chop Let's money. Let's be realistic. Let's be realistic <laughs> about it. So those commissions we have, how are we strengthening it to make sure that they work? Setting up another supervisory commission Doesn't is going to take sense. a lot of resources, resources that we don't have. Maybe we're supposed to be managing... To be managing for... So they have, they have scrapped Ministry of um, Sports Development and now everybody will now fall under National Sports Commission. So maybe the National Sports Commission would, exactly would have like, um, no, because commission would mean that your tenure is not bound by um, the administration. Maybe you have like five years or something, so we can see a more um, long-term approach. I don't know, but <sighs> maybe they will now give us more information, a proper document about how the, the difference, what will happen. Mm. Because I know they will not, all this scrapping does not suck anybody. Yeah. Just, so, then, so, 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 then, so, so, they're not used to de develop under the commission. Mm -mm. It's not difficult. Sometimes I don't even understand what Ministry this one is doing, development. what this one is doing. There's always been like, Ministry I don't of get Sport it. Development and there's always been National Sports Commission. So now, they are merging yeah, them together. Yeah. And they are merging them. So let's be optimistic. We Amaka. are optimistic. Well, oh, oh. <laughs> please, but please, can we talk about, please, can <laughs> we talk about, <laughs> yeah, but can we talk about, <laughs> uh, who does anybody know about uh, this, the, the Ministry of Livestock? Livestock, we're talking about, so. Uh, uh, please don't talk about what you involved. don't know. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Okay, so the, what happened to the Ministry of Livestock? It's very no, important. No, yeah, no, I'm so, no, so I'm yeah. seeing it. It's a major issue. It's a major issue now because there's no food now. So seeing it excites me. So that's what I want to say. That Does anybody really know about this person now? Maybe that they should be under the Ministry of Agriculture. Well, yeah, so no, we, no, have, the of of we have Idi Mukta um, Maiha. He's a minister, has a Ministry of Livestock. He's going to be mm. now be in charge of that. So we'll see how that goes. But one, one of the things I want also to talk about is um, there was one I was interested in right now. I just lost it. I think is education. So hey, we need we need we, need, we didn't um the caller had mentioned why he thought they should have sacked the minister of, of education. Mm. Okay. And while, while you're talking, I was saying that there are other um educationists who deserve that role. Now we don't know this Prof person, this new person, yeah. Professor. I'm, I'm trying to get PhD. his name now. He has a, he has a, a, let me see the minister of um, education. Why um Shuaiba Said Ahmed PhD. Mm. So we don't know who he is. I'm right hoping now. indeed that he's also a square peg in a square hole because yeah. the truth is that. There's quite a bit of issues within the educational sector. There's still that uh, perception that um, our own the curriculum. Lady. Is it a lady? Yes. Oh. Yes. She's a trained Amazing. educationist, gender Amazing. advocate, and consultant. Um, uh -huh. She has been in the field of education for 17 years. Uh -huh. Exactly. So we're just learning Fantastic. about these ministers, mm -hmm. and hopefully we'll get to know them more about them because mm -hmm. it's just 24 hours. So we're still trying to figure out who is who mm -hmm. in, 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 in the coming days. But for now, we're hoping that this person will be able to do. Um, she's fairly kind young. of work required yeah. in the in the in the ministry of education. We need a lot of regeneration in that sense. Fairly young. I remember the first, the last minister that I felt made major impact in the ministry of education was obviously Kwesini because there was yes. that one eh, yes. was a major shake up. He yes. was like, I'm willing to put my child in the public school. Yes. I'm willing to, like that kind of selfless service is yes. what I want displayed in all these ministers yeah. that we're bringing in. Some some people were, take, were saying online. Okay, want to take a call. Take a Latif. Good morning, Latif. Thanks for calling. your live. Good morning. How are you? My good morning, sir. Very good. On the other night, I work. Hey, I want to speak on uh, the issue of uh, commission. There is not so much commission. And the nation is coming to uh, every region is waiting for commission. I think it is better to advise by one by one ministry. Besides that, I want to make a little correction about how to make pronunciation. Do something like Thank you. 
Pas du faire mon pas du faire du moins du pour les gens qui le font. So the, the lady, the PhD lady, is actually Minister of State for Education. Okay. Um, the what the substantive. president, the substantive minister, is uh, I just got his name this second now. Um, was oh, just lost it. I just had it. But yeah, she's actually the Minister of State for that's Education. That's a PhD doctor, um, um, doctor Aman. Yusuf Tanko. Yes, that's Sununu. the minister. So that's we need to know education. his, yes. all, his, his uh, pedigree uh, and know exactly yeah. if indeed he's going to be. Um, yeah, go ahead. You know, I said some people are saying that. What's the difference between Wiki's uh, approach and the Uju Kennedy's She's approach? That, 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 was, that, that, was the, that was the difference in their approach. That She's nobody, that they didn't mention Wiki in this matter. Mm. And then Uju, that what is the difference Woman, in their approach? But you see, so people are, are go to Abuja, upset about people this. People are saying Wiki is working on. Like, like there's nobody yes. Mm. Yes. that I've met. Yes. In, from the driver yes. to the big man to the regular folks, everybody are saying that yeah. this Wiki man is working on. Yeah, so working. the Gragra approach is good. Mm but achieve results. Mm -hmm. So now, let's what are the results Dr. Uji Kennedy was supposed to achieve that she's not active because, so it's not, maybe it's not the gra-gra yeah. that is the issue. Maybe it's the, the result. Let us know. Yeah, okay, I, I, think think also, I think it's also the gra-gra. You know, the way they judge gra-gra. We can do gra-gra. Gender, gender, gender gra-gra. Yeah. When a man does, he says assertive. Yeah. When a woman is assertive, they say it's aggression. Yes. Mm. That's, that's how true. they judge it. That's so true. till we get to a point where we are looking beyond mm. how they are acting based on their personality the to the content mm. and the job they are doing, mm. we'll keep saying, because we are expected that women, uh, women will have soft, a way of being soft, you know, say it gently, respectfully, you are a woman after all. Well, you are a yes. husband's house. house. Don't you respect yes. your husband? I have your type in my house. Those are some of the things that we see that, okay, no, this one is too harsh. Yeah. We don't want this. So um, the minister, the, the, you know, the, all these new ministers that they're bringing in will still have to get through, go through Senate um, screening. 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 Okay. So you know, nothing really cast in stone yet, but we would like the Senate to carry out a tra um, the, the broadcast, they should um, broadcast the screening so we can see, I, we can hear the just questions. Just about five now, just seven the, Yes, we can hear the questions because uh, going through um, the details about the minister for, the, the person that they're appointing for livestock, I feel like it would be, he would be a good person because he understands ranching, he's done business with, the, he's, he, that's what he does, ranching. Okay. And it would be a great thing, sir, if you can take cows from the streets of Nigeria because it is not expected that you are walking the streets of a nation and you are jamming cows. Okay, you are driving I disagree with on you. the streets of Abuja, you are jamming cow. On Third Milan Bridge, no, not Third Milan Bridge. I disagree. Uh, me, I saw on Third Milan Bridge. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, me. No, no, no. Uh, I mean that. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Even, even jam, I myself. I've seen someone that, I've, I've, I've seen a jamming of cow mm -hmm. just after Third Milan Bridge. Mm -hmm. oh. it should, these things should not happen. Wait, okay, so my is... appeal is our minister for livestock. Let me land my appeal. Land, 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 land. Please, land appeal, please, put our livestock away from the roads. Okay. Thank you. Now, I think that is debatable. Mm. The reason why I say that, because I've been to countries where they are pushing sheep off the road. Mm. They are pushing sheep because the, call, the people have accepted, this is our culture. We have farmers in this region. They're entering certain communities. That's the region. You, you, you that's understand? The region. I mean, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's, like, it's debatable. Mm. Because we need to also accept our culture. These are people's lifestyle for centuries. So they are also, there's a, there's a, there's a debate that you have been uh, modern and say that, take them off our streets because we don't have the skyscrapers. We're saying, this, this, this is our lifestyle. We've been doing this for years. So, Maybe they the designate way, designate some areas. Yes, yes. Yes. So, now, now, we are, now we are meeting, Abuja. Yeah, now cities. we are meeting halfway. We're mm. saying that, recognize mm. that there are areas where cows can walk the streets yes. because that's the community. Thank you for reminding yes. me because there are some places Specific where areas. they have like a um, deer zone, even in uh, uh, Abuja. See you, now, they are you know already. But it's there. So when I go to that area, because you will know that you, know you have to slow down and be aware of the animals exactly. here. But I can't be driving on Third Milan. I can't be driving on Third Milan Bridge. Yeah, and then, and then no, a cow we agree just, with you. Yes. Yes. Respect my areas. area. If I want cows to walk, in that's fine. No problem. Fantastic. That's Your be. area. Going on now. Let's move. Who else are we talking about? Let's see. Um, <laughs> What we should have been with folks spoken about. Not Minister of so this, this, Employment. This, not spoken about. Our, my darling, this Jamila, Dr. Jamila. We didn't talk about uh, this uh, doctor. Um, she was the minister. She's gone. She's one that was sacked. Oh, the Minister, yeah, Minister of for Youth Development. So, you know, she came in late. I, there was issues about me, who's going to be... I mean, she's such a pretty woman, young... <laughs> Let's not talk about the pretty sex, because that would distract from... Okay, so she's yeah. But her CV was... She had very a very impressive, solid CV. Impressive, yeah. impressive, did solid she, did CV. deliver? Because I don't, don't know. know. Again, you don't know the KPI. I, I also feel that sometimes mm -hmm. before we bring in um, new, like, 
totally new people into being ministers. It would be nice, like the case of uh, Dr. Joe Duwale, where you've done, you've served maybe in the nat National Economic um, Council. Mm -hmm. You've worked, like you've served within, you've understood yeah, how to deal know with you. Yeah. Polit no, politicians and ministry. Yeah. Because you might be, this Heged, you are very good, uh -huh. but you don't know how to deal with ministries and, and politicians. politicians. And it might not become yeah. a stumbling block for your performance. Thank you. It goes back to what we talked about yesterday. yesterday. You bring their brothers. Mm. Oh, he went to Harvard. He's the best. Mm. And, and now put them in the ministry. Mm. And then they fall apart. Because, because yeah. So you need somebody yeah. who has... Don't yeah, do a returnee. Small. Maybe yeah. do a Lagos. Do a returnee. Or do your sports. But you can still work in different ministries for a while. I I'm still like me now. I am a returnee, but I have entered the system. I know what they are. I'm fully qualified. But anyway, so the point is that we can't. We, we bring them raw like that. Mm. Sometimes they might have they might issues. So with um, there was one issue you want to talk about. Yeah, um, so, but does anybody know uh, about the? Because I'm looking at the Minister of um, Humanitarian Affairs and Poverty Reduction. You know that that ministry was one the, controversial. The controversial. Yeah, that so whether we know whether that this new person now, so Doctor Nentawe, yeah, um, Yeah, so the ministry is a new. Um, Minister designate for uh, humanitarian affairs and poverty reduction. Mm. We don't know much about this person, but I'm sure as in the coming days we'll do more research about them. He's trying to he's a, exactly. he's a man. He's a man. Um, she's, she's a professor. It up. A, mm. So we'll see. We'll see more of their CV. We'll get, read more about them. Come, these are people that hopefully we'll be bringing them on the show at some point mm. to um, share with us their vision and their plans for these ministries. Mm. But the one I was really concerned about this number eight. Um, the appointment of Sunday Dari. You know, Sunday Dari is a friend of the house. Yeah. Um, appointment of Sunday Dari as the special advisor to Mr. President on public communication and orientation, working from the Ministry of Information and National mm -hmm. Orientation. And now, still. is that... He, yeah. he was... Yeah. The, the guy was... That no, was, no, was, his, was his, what was he doing before? Was sports in the former... Oh, yes, yes, yes. yes, yes was yes, sports. Yes, he was so now, sports. But he yeah. used to work with the president yes. as, a, as a, I think it was a personal assistant many years ago. Mm -hmm. okay. So now he's back as special advisor to the president on public communication orientation. I don't know what that yeah. means, but mm. does it sound like um, Mungalali is... Yeah, 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 but they said that from, they said it's from the Ministry of now. Information and National mm. Orientation. I know, so but within, since he's the are those roles public not, communication, yes, because... Yes, it's not the same. Because Sorry. this administration has a problem with the communication that Nigerians can understand. You see, you are <laughs> doing the work. The text is there, right? But sometimes it's too... Um, cumbersome, I would say, I say it for, for Nigerians to, to, to internalize. Mm. You remove subsidy. Dangote is supposed to be selling to us, mm. which all we know is What's that we're paying 1,000 yeah, naira and 50. Right. Yes. So somebody really needs to hard. We don't break it down. It it's down. down. So hopefully, Sunday it Dari might, might be doing that just. So I know, I know, um, Ngalali, mm -hmm. Njuri, Ajuri tried. 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 Really I can did. understand an Ajuri's yeah. press it, release. Yes, yes. but there's somebody. But English is quite above yeah, a but, lot of Nigerians. So somebody else. At the, at the level, maybe I'm not a higher educator, might yes. not understand. Yes. So we need so, somebody who can bring it down. Because I had suggested once to, when I had the opportunity, some of these um, the, the people, the guys came to, I think, TVC at some point. The, I think the Ministry of Information, I believe, came to, to the office. And I had suggested, I said, listen, the same way we have daily press briefing mm. in, in, in the US, or where, where yeah. the, the, the correspondents are constantly waiting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or if, if the only thing the president did today was wake up, and sleep. Tell us. Come at 5 p.m. every day. I know that, okay, there's somebody going to come and tell mm. Today, the president just woke up, he had mm. breakfast, yeah. and then he went to bed. Mm. No meetings today. Thank you very much. See you tomorrow. Yes. Tuesday, come again. Yeah. 5 o'clock. I know that every single 5 o'clock mm. day, I'm hearing from Asso Rock yeah. yes. on what the president did, doing. what the minister are told to do. Mm -hmm. So when I'm getting that daily briefing, mm. if social media shows up, they say, eh, president, that's yeah, not they, true. That's not true. You have information. You have mm. daily information. Yeah. You are downloading it in piecemeal capsules every yeah. single day. Mm. Because when you come up with Can this heavy... That? Hey, yes, can't, so you can't, must. They can't. You they have must. Ministry, you have, I mean, if you, you, are you, you that constantly that give them this, your press releases, yeah. nobody gets it. Yeah. But if you break it out in small, 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 small bits, people yeah. can actually understand and assimilate. Have conversations with the people so and these are, I agree. I yes. agree with this. It's important. Yeah. As, 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 as um, what's the word I'm doing? It's a cumbersome. As the matter we could be to be mm. planning no, a bit If you chunk it down, it it Yeah, because the layman, what they keep seeing is everybody just angry and so. But if you break it down, every single day, and you know that we always have the presidency has it team of people, press people that, are all, that always have to show up at, that, or those, at those places and they can ask questions. And that exactly. way we can get clarity. Somebody can say, okay, the English, I don't understand it, but if I now ask you a question, you will not have to, you'll be forced to explain it to me and Nigerians can understand, understand the explanation better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, still, they say Nigeria cannot grow without um, Ajakuta working. We can't grow without the steel. We can't grow because we, we, don't, we can't manufacture anything if we don't have the raw material through iron. 
So um, whoever is a minister for steel is going to have a lot of work. Mm, yeah. The former person, um, the minister for state for steel has been moved to uh, minister for state for regional development. Um, Sometimes we do these moves, like I said, it's not, we will not know until much I think we can ra wrap up on this. Mm. I'm not sure there's any other thing to discuss on it, but mm. what, 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 what we'll probably need is in, in the coming days, we get more of their CV, uh, what they've done, so we can even um, adequately talk about them and the, our expectations of them. But this is just based on this list that was released mm. yesterday. Mm -hmm. So we can still give ourselves some time to um, see who and who let's is on the list. And dig up yeah, let's get more information about this. From their... I think we can, let's take a few comments. <laughs> let's take a few comments and then we wrap up on this. Let me see who else is sending us messages on this. Who has comments, thoughts on this? We can say, take a few before uh, we go. Lumide Bola on YouTube here says, the sacked Minister of Women Affairs clashed during hearing with a panel set up by House of Reps to investigate accusation made against her by some contractors for delaying their payments. Yeah, we saw that. Yeah, we saw that video. Okay, I think that's all we can take on this, but really in a nutshell, congratulations to the newly appointed um, uh, ministers, and we hope that uh, they're able to be properly screened once they go through the screening, and once they become substantive ministers, we'll try to see if we can bring them on the show to tell Nigerians what they plan to do. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back.